All right, guys, we're back, and it has been a long time coming, but uh, we're going to do another one of these, and according to our first reaction, everybody was telling us we needed to check out the stripped versions because they were better. You get more for vocal um, power in those, so that's what we're here for. I'm all about vocals and harmonies. I love that. And she's incredible. The, the first song we reacted to two years ago was absolutely phenomenal. And Alana loves her music. So, let's check this out. Thousia, I hope I say that right. I'm horrible with names, guys. Just let me know in the comments if I'm butchering her name. Thousia, Born Without a Heart, stripped. Right here on Russell Family Reactions. Let's go full screen and let's get into this. I'm an angel, tell me what you mean by that Jesus I take it all and I will never give it okay. back I don't feel sorry every time I see you cry Jesus, man Every time you start, I'm waiting for your tears to dry she has so much power. I don't really care, and I never will. That's the way I am, such a bitter pill. I don't really care how my silence kills. That's the way I am. No, I wasn't born without a heart. I wasn't always like this. No, Jesus. Watch you break. Me, no, now I blame you. Love. I wasn't born with all these scars, and not so many me like this. No, can you blame me? No, oh, oh, I'm not. Oh, my God, can she has a really powerful voice? Yes, extremely powerful. And really what she's doing that is not being really mentioned, or at least not that I'm aware of, is, yes, she has a ton of power, but she is in full control of it, too. Because you can tell, like, when she starts projecting, she she's pulling back a lot. Like, she could really let this go, but... And if I remember... We do get into this power at the end of this song just a little bit more than we are right now. Yeah. If I remember correctly, because it's been a while since I've listened to this song. So, but like, when I'm training my voice, I use one of her songs so I can like learn how to control my voice the way that she does. Yeah. So, uh, that's. <laughs> so I find artists like her that know how to control her voice and like bring back that power. I use those songs to actually learn how to control my voice in my own way. Yeah, because she's she's a vocal, uh, she's a beast, dude. Like she's a vocal powerhouse. A vocal powerhouse beast. Like. Like I said, she's pulling back a lot when she projects, and she's projecting with a lot of power even pulled back. I don't know if we could handle her full projection. I don't know either. Because it might blow my headphones up. <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> incredible. And I I love her little, her, I love her nuances and stuff in her vocal too. Um, she has a completely accentuated vocal. Um, which means she adds her, I'm guessing this is like her, like her, her regional accent on with her, mixed with her vocal projection. When she's, when she's projecting her vocal tone and she's singing it, she's also adding her accent, people, which gives it an even more unique flair. What? People don't realize how beautiful a, um. An vibrato is. Am I saying that great? Right? The vibrato. Yeah, vibrato. They don't realize how beautiful it is when when you put it in a song all the time. 
throughout every single one. Yeah, it does sound a little choppy. But she's using her vibrato in a perfect way to where it just sounds completely natural. And yeah. she has really control over her vibrato, too. Because you can have control over your vibrato. Yeah. It's you very can have control to. over any part of your vocal. The vibrato. Um, even people that have rasp can control their rasp. Like, because... You have to learn to do it, but you can do it. Because, like, look at, like, rock bands and stuff. How do you think they can have that rocky texture in their voice? Because they learned how to control vibrato and mix it with a rasp, rasp to give you that power Grittiness. Yeah. and grit. Uh, so, like, you can have complete troll, like, because you can tell that sometimes, like, artists can smooth out their voice as well, but they still have that rasp and that grit, but they can get rid of it in, like, two seconds flat, and you're like, okay, what happened? Yeah. Right, oh, my God. She, she is killing us. She is. I've never heard the song before, but she's killing us. Like this, no, can you blame me? No, oh, oh, I'm a nightmare. I know what you mean by that. I can't wake up from all scary dreams I that was a nice subtle touch right there when really she did that. Care and yeah. I never will. That's the way I am, such a bitter pill. I don't really care how my silence kills. That's the way I am. No, I wasn't born without a heart. I wasn't always like this. No, watch you break me. No. I also like how I'm going to back it up because I, I don't want to miss any part of this song. This is incredible, amazing, true um, vocal artistry, and it's incredible, and it needs to be appreciated for what it is and how incredible she is. With that being said, when she does that, uh, when, uh, when she does that um, vocal run, and she lets her vocal ride out like that. It almost sounds like a yodel. You know what I'm saying? Um, when it does that, like, echoing and reverbing, where it, like, sounds... Ooh. Yeah, like, when it when it echoes out. Yeah, she It adds, almost sounds like a yodel. She adds just a little bit of her vibrato and just carries it out. Like, it's like she's switching from, like... Uh, I'm probably going to get the note wrong, but like from a sharp to a note very quickly and just slowing it and carrying it out and letting it soften. Yeah. Uh, but I think that's what she's doing with that. Just And adding that vibrato just makes it sound a little bit smoother from the transition. Yeah, it just it sounds incredible. Um, and it, it's just another one of those um, characteristics that characteristics that she has vocally that's really exceptional. And uh, gives her a completely unique sounding voice um, apart from anybody else. Like I said, it almost sounds... I know it's not a yodel. Uh, yodel. But she, I know it's not a yodel. But, but I'm saying the quality a, of it sounds similar to a yodel. Yeah, uh, she just adds enough texture to just make it sound smoother than a yodel. To where yeah. it doesn't sound completely like a yodel, but it does have that texture that you get from a yodel. Yeah. Exceptional though. I wasn't always like this. No. Watch you break me. No. Now you blame me. I wasn't born with all these girls. And not so many men. Jesus. I wasn't born without 
<laughs> oh my god, dude. No, we can't let that go by. <laughs> that was so I'm glad absolutely that, phenomenal, man. I'm glad that I did get the right song with that. Uh, production because I didn't know if it was in this song or if it was in Tears of Gold. Um, yeah, because like she started, she started with that vocal run at a lower tone and just gradually just kept increasing the octave up, and that was like you don't. By the end, you were like, "Oh my god!" You don't really get to see a lot of her higher range in Tears of Gold, but in this one, it really just comes through, and she used a lot of that power to make her voice go higher. Yeah, that that was exceptional, exceptional. Because <laughs> sometimes you can just make your voice sound higher without changing what note you're on, just by adding more power. Because that power echoing through echoing through echoing, your vocals yeah. makes it sound higher than you actually are singing. Mm-hmm. That's incredible. I gotta hear it again though. I'm sorry, but she does have a good range. Yes, I'm. I'm sorry. I'm having to go back, but. Greatness, when you're listening to vocal greatness like this, it requires that you go back and re-listen multiple times if necessary. In pieces, oh, 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 Jesus. stand by my assumption she is a vocal beast and i still even after hearing that amazing incredible vocal performance that she just did i still think there's more power to her than that like she could seriously hurt your eardrums she's probably just she might be training her vo vocals to handle that much power that she has or she may maybe not or maybe she does know how to control it, and she just thinks that the <laughs> audience isn't ready for it. Could be that too. Um, but that was that was amazing. I mean, I'm talking about. She had me in the clouds with that one, guys. That's stratospheric. You know what I mean? Like, you're just like, oh, this is so awesome. <laughs> because that was amazing. That really was amazing. Uh, but like I said, she's a vocal beast, man. Like, I really do. I mean, I know she hit some high notes in there. But I really do think she has more power behind her than that. I, I really think she can project more than that. It's just I don't think our eardrums can handle it. I really don't. Uh, because if she put her full projection in on in force on that, she might even bust the mics. Just saying. That was amazing. In the description of this video, I'm going to have a link to this performance. Make sure you guys come over here and check it out and drop a like. I will also have a link to her official YouTube channel. Make sure you come over here, hit that subscribe button, turn the bells on so that you're notified each and every time she drops new content. Because that was exceptional, you guys. She's putting out a really incredible, powerful music. And uh, we want her to continue to do that. So we're going to throw our support behind her. And we want you guys to, too. Um, with that being said, if you enjoyed our reaction, make sure you drop a like on our video. If you have not subscribed to our channel yet, please subscribe and join our family here. This is what we do. We listen to incredible, amazing, fantastic, stratospheric music like this. We react to it and we talk about it with you guys. Uh, go in the comments section and give us some more song requests and suggestions for Fauja. Um, If you have another artist or band or group that you would like for us to check out, then they have amazing vocals or just really put out incredible music and you think we would enjoy reacting to it, 
drop that in the comments as well, and we'll get those up for y'all as soon as we possibly can. Uh, once again, you guys, thank you so much for checking this out with us tonight. It was Fausia with Born Without a Heart Stripped, and you heard it right here on Russell Family Reactions. And as always, you guys, catch you on the flip side. What she said. Thank you.